everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So we're going to take a look at the leaderboards. We've got round one of the infamous Iron Man and Wolverine Arena. Wolverine, for the first time, is available as a six star, and he is in the arena featured. And then infamous Iron Man is in the basic. So we're going to take a look at the leaderboards, and I'm very curious as to what the cutoff is. And I'll talk a little bit about why I'm wondering whether the cutoff is going to be a little bit different than what we might expect. So as you can see, I have not touched these, and I won't do any of these. Uh, I finished my arena grind Friday, so I have not touched the arena since. We also have a level up going on. Uh, as you can see, I have not done my level up. I'm waiting to see what the last um, event is, and then I'll probably just rank up, because I really don't have anybody big that I want to rank up right now. So I'll probably just rank up my uh, Viv Vision as a five-star. So, all right, let's take a look here. All right, uh, 11 to 30% is what I normally get. That's what I aim for. Uh, let's start with Infamous Iron Man. Now, Infamous Iron Man is the current highest prestige champion in the game. He is also my only rank five. So um, if people have not gotten him and if they are wanting to do that prestige uh, race, they're going to have to get him. So I think he's still going to go pretty high. However, here is what's going on right now. In case you're watching this video um, long into the future or you just haven't heard, Kabam made a change. And it is really annoying let's just say it that way it's very annoying and the solution that they have for um making the change uh, it's not good and it, it's not set in stone so we may still have um a, a better solution but anyway what they've done there were and this has been known for years there are certain quests low level quests that you can go to and basically farm revives. It has a very high chance of dropping revives. I myself have used it and many, many, many people have used it. And their complaint about that is that it trivializes content. I get that complaint. Mind you, it's been around for a long time and I have my own feelings about this uh, things that they could have done, and that this is a symptom rather than the problem. You know, for example, why not design content that's not revive spammable and doesn't require 70 and 80 revives to get through, you know? But anyway, so that's what they have done. They are removing that, and what they have proposed to replace that with it's not good it's trash okay it's just it's trash but they are still in talks about that so we do still have a chance that it is not the final solution but the reason that i brought that up is that people feel so strongly about it they've been talking about it pretty much all week and some people have quit the game some people are threatening to quit the game. Um, it, it's 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 bad, okay? People do not like this at all. Considering the state of the game right now where the inputs are not working quite right, people are having all sorts of troubles where because of the inputs, they're using more revives. So you have a fight where they may use revives for no reason of their own has nothing to do with skill. You know, I myself have had plenty of times where I've died 
just because of the inputs. I I, I go dashing. I'm I'm hitting my combo, and suddenly it dashes backwards, and that throws me off. And then bam, I get hit up, caught a special, whatever. Uh, there are times where I've hit my special, and instead of my special firing, their special fires. Now, you might think, oh, well, that's just because you probably were just too slow. I started spamming my special while they were on the ground, and it would not fire my special. And they got up and fired their special. Okay? So, yeah. The game has issues. And they decide to tackle this. So, yeah, there's a lot of uh, bad feelings. And I wonder if that affects the cutoffs. Are people wanting to even bother grinding to get these champions, you know, especially how they feel right now? I don't know. All right. We went through the um, uh, leaderboards. Uh, even I was talking, so I may have missed you. I'm sorry if I did. Um, but let's see who is Summoner 101. Hondu, I do not know you. Um, but yeah, if I, if I did not call out your name, I'm sorry. Leave a comment below and, uh, let me know. Ooh, Ricardo. I went to school with a Ricardo. Um, let me know what your score was and your ranking and all of that, especially for this round, because it will really help a lot of people out. It'll help them plan out if they're planning to go for this champion, help them plan their next grind. Now, uh, of course, infamous Iron Man has been available for a while. You know, I have him. And so you may have a lot of people that already have him. So that could also have affected the cutoffs. So yeah, I'm, I'm just very curious to see um, what the cutoffs were. So definitely leave leave a comment and let me know. Okay. LeBron's? LeBron's? Okay. <laughs> Captain Wiles. All right. That's all right. Whoop it. Whoop it good. Paul Purgis. Uh-huh. Paul Delano. Or Delano. Sub-Zero. Although I like Sub-Zero, I was always into uh, Scorpion more than uh, Sub-Zero. Get over here. J4 is awesome. Whoa. -ho -ho. Congrats on that five star. Let me know how you like him. He's actually, if you haven't seen my video, I did a video on him. So definitely give it a, a look. All right, now let's go over here to my boy, Wolverine. Now, if the arena was a little different, I would have gone for Wolverine, mainly because I like him. I like Wolverine. Hulk is my number one favorite Marvel champion. Not in the game, just, you know, from the comics growing up. Hulk. He was always my boy. Love Hulk. Loved his story. Loved the stuff he went through. He, he was my boy. Okay. Second and third, actually they're really tied for second, would be Spider-Man and Wolverine. I had their comics. I read their comics. I, I Anything that had Wolverine in it, I was going to be reading. Okay. Um, let's, let's see who picked up this six-star Wolverine. And, you know, X-Men, oh, yeah. I remember he he also, you know, I think it was X-Factor. He would sometimes be in there. And the last comic that I read was around, oh, I see you, Lemon, um, the time where he got his adamantium ripped out of him by Magneto. So what happened around that time was they did a, a spinoff 
comic, just Wolverine. I think that's all it was called, Wolverine. And they were trying to, I guess they were trying to do a reboot for him. They were trying to make it so that he was even more terrifying than he was before because the adamantium was holding back his healing factor. And so now he was healing, you know, so much more than he ever did before. And it was already awesome. So, you know, they made it so that, you know, he'd get into a fight and they would hit him and he'd be healing before he even hit the ground, you know, he'd be fully healed, stuff like that. Um, but I stopped reading. I collected that comic for a while, but it just wasn't Wolverine. You took away his adamantium. But then I heard later, because I wasn't the only one that thought that, um, they, they, I don't know, retconned him. I think that's what they call it. I don't know. Um, but they went back and they were like, oh, well, that wasn't really Wolverine. That was some uh, changeling or alien or something from someplace else. And the real Wolverine was actually uh, in prison somewhere and, you know, all that. I don't know. Um, just seemed like a, a cheap way for them to go, oops, we messed up. Wait, what? <laughs> hey, congratulations on your Wolverine. Now, I will be making a video that you guys will see tomorrow. I haven't started it yet, but I'm going to make it um, today where I'm going to go on to the CCP server, which I haven't done in such a long time, and make a video on Wolverine. And I am very curious. I see other people have done it, but I have not watched. I want to do it myself. Uh, Black Cat, congratulations. So I am very curious. Sir Quixote, ooh, an angry elephant. I know you're happy now. Now, when this Wolverine comes to the um, basic arena, I'll probably go for him. If I don't have him already. Husky Lemon, we got lemonade. That cool, refreshing drink. Uh, I will be trying to get him, though. Baba Yaga. Yaga. And... If I have not gotten him, Ghost Shadow, I will go for him in the arena. All right, Evil Knievel slipped in there, and then we've got Killers. Killer. Congratulations. You're the cutoff, man. What score did you put up? If you see this, let me know what score you put up. Be very curious to see what the cutoff was. All right, let's see who is Summoner 101. Antrex! I know you're not happy. I wouldn't be happy. Oh, time to shine. I know you're not happy either, man. Are you going to go round two? That's what I want to know. Now, I don't know, like I said, um, whether the uh, current issue going on affected the cutoffs or what my prediction was like 280 million you know and uh that was like for the safe score but there's no telling maybe he went crazy low and these folks weren't really going for him and they were just trying to get the five star i don't know i see sub-zero again i can't tell if that's the same as the other one though you know folks spell them differently it may have a period and the other one didn't stuff like that so not sure monkey d killer okay all right so i do see some people i usually see on the leaderboards here maybe for round one they were just testing the waters that's what i would do i would have um just gone for the five star if i didn't have it and then go further because even though the five star has been available, it's still kind of rare. Um, so I think a lot of people don't have a, even a five star Wolverine. So this is a perfect time to pick up a five star Wolverine. And then, you know, round two, grab yourself that six star. But I will be waiting. I'll be opening crystals, hoping to get him. Uh, when he's available in the crystals and then i will 
grind for him in the basic if I don't have him by then. Anyway, that is going to do it for this video. Uh, take care. Hit the like button. If you enjoyed it, it helps me grow. Um, make sure you watch for the video on Six Star Wolverine tomorrow. So take care, and you all have a blessed day. Thank you.